With Sweden and Finland currently ascending into NATO, many are beginning to ask who would be next to join the organization. Well, to begin with, NATO doesn't accept members with territorial disputes, as membership into the organization would put NATO at war with another nation on day one. Because of this rule, for now, we have to put aside Georgia, Moldova, Cyprus, and Ukraine. We also have to take Russia, Belarus, and Armenia out of contention as they're already a part of the Russian version of NATO, the CSTO. Serbia won't join as it has close ties to Russia, and also the issue of Kosovo. Switzerland is always neutral. Austria maintaining its neutrality was built into the original NATO deals. Ireland has a policy of military neutrality. Azerbaijan has an increasingly aggressive foreign policy, and one that NATO doesn't officially want to get involved with, which in Europe, excluding the microstates, only leaves Bosnia and Herzegovina, who in itself is struggling with internal tensions between its Bosnia and Serb populations, something that NATO membership would be very likely to temporarily exacerbate. So for now, in Europe, it seems that NATO is about as big as it's going to get. 